What's up YouTube, Dimux here and today we are breaking down the classic Kingdom trailer for Kingdom Hearts 3 that was revealed during the Kingdom Hearts Union Cross Dandelion meeting. Even though the trailer is only 58 seconds long, there's actually a good amount of content to cover. So without further ado, let's get into it. Right off the bat, the Tram Common area for Twilight Town got a complete graphic overhaul with a tree in between various shops and some NPCs socializing in the background. Speaking of shops, you can see the classic item shop on the right where Roxas had to find this old lady's fucking cat that didn't even go anywhere. Also, if you look to the top left, you'll see a sign that looks like a shop that sells gummy materials, for the gummy ship of course, and the shop in the background is called Le Grand Bistrot. I did some research, and if you type up that name in Google, you'll discover that this is the name of a restaurant in Paris. So... Fine dining from Chef Ignis confirmed? Also, there's a wine bottle by a trash can, possibly hinting at an E10 plus rating? Eh, maybe I'm reaching. Also, this trailer confirms the return of... Who were Roxas' fake friends in the beginning of Kingdom Hearts 2, which is kind of sad when you think about it. They're also sporting new outfits with Hainer and Alette hopping on that plaid trend, which begs the question, with all these characters getting new outfits, how come Donald and Goofy don't get new threads as well? Sure that they could use some new powers to go up against Xehanort and his new 13 Seagulls of Darkness, am I right? And as a side note, I think this reunion with the Vacation Trio might be taking place before Sora, Donald and Goofy encounter Xemnas and Ansem's Secret of Darkness at the Old Mansion. With that being said, to celebrate Sora's return to Twilight Town, I believe Hainer, Pence, and Alette give Sora Classic Kingdom, a handheld gaming device that allows Sora to play over 20 special mini-games inspired by classic Disney cartoons and 1980s LSD games, which can be discovered throughout Sora's adventure in Kingdom Hearts 3. Some of the minigames that were shown off in the trailer were the Barnyard Battle, where you control Sora and Mickey with the objective having them to smash enemies with a hammer, and if you miss, you lose. Then there's the Carvina Kid, where Sora has to serve the right food for each customer in a certain amount of time. And then we have Giant Land, which was revealed at D23 Japan earlier this year. In this minigame, you have to avoid the giant's attacks, use the pepper to have the giant launch Sora into the air, and swing on the candles to safety. And last but not least is Musical Farmer where Sora has to rearrange pipes to collect a certain amount of eggs. And the trailer ends with Sora showing off his pearly white teeth and seems to be having a fun time playing Classic Kingdom. Just wait until you play King's Knight. So let me just think in the comments and download about the Classic Kingdom minigames for Kingdom Hearts 3. Honestly, I don't see myself playing these minigames a whole ton when I have Kingdom Hearts 3, but you never know, we'll have to wait and see. I'm pretty sure Square Enix is going to have leaderboards available, that way you can try to beat other people's high scores. And if you guys are expecting a lot of Kingdom Hearts 3 content to be revealed at the Dandelion meeting, you probably should have lowered your expectations because this was an event highlighting the mobile game, not Kingdom Hearts 3. But I can guarantee Kingdom Hearts 3 will be showing off tons of content in full force at E3 within the next two months. What? If you want your name to appear in Kingdom Hearts 3, hop on Kingdom Hearts Union Cross and play the Make a Mark event, but here's the catch. You have to be among the top 500 players to be considered, and there's only 14 days left. So get grinding, motherfucker! So if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that like button. It really helps me out to subscribe for more content from me on Kingdom Hearts 3 and other games in general. I'm Demolex, Austin in the future.